Hello friends! Today I will tell you about my experience with K-pop, why it's my most preferred choice for music these days, why I love it and why I prefer K-pop artists instead of other artists and many other stuff. So let's jump into it! So here I am showing the color inspiration for the today's project. I was really inspired by the colors of these socks, so yeah. When it was 2011, I was watching to some kind of videos on YouTube and accidentally I saw Thumbnail with 2NE1 performing I am the best, so I clicked it and then the magic for me started. At first for 4 or 5 years I've listened only to 2NE1 and Big Bang songs. I've had every song the girls were putting out. I was so amazed by their talent and stage presence. They were performing live almost every time, if not every time, singing and dancing at the same time. So the second thing I like about to anyone are their visuals, their style was something really out of this world, like as you know I am a fashion designer so it's like I've created them in only in my sketches, so new and fresh. Number three, I love their personalities. The girls were some kind down to earth, relatable, they had many videos backstage before performing on stage where they were just making fun and reminded me of my high school days where we were making art and having so much fun and doing stuff that we shouldn't. I loved about them that every member had its own character like CL was the leader Bomb was the voice, Dara was the cutest, and Minzy's dancing was killing it. My bias was and still is Spark Bomb, and I have dreamed to make someday clothes for her, like she has one song with Epic High that is called Up, and there her vocals are on another level like they were so epic uh, on the live performance like she was performing like from the galaxy like her voice is made for the galaxy not for this planet and she's amazing so i was so captivated by their music that i wanted to become k-pop designer one day but some kind of this dream, maybe it's too unreachable, I don't think there's something unachievable, but my country is so far away from Korea and I don't know Korean too, so that, that is a struggle too. I'm sorry that you hear me turning the pages, yes I have script and I literally want to share with you my personal experiences with the stuff I'm interested in and I don't know if you guys like it. I don't get any feedback from you yet but I hope that in the future that will change so please subscribe to my channel and comment. If you like what I'm doing I will be very grateful if you do that. 
So yes, do anyone were my fashion inspiration? Their looks were so ahead of their time and during this time I've studied for taking my bachelor's degree in fashion so I was aiming to become so good at styling, sewing, grading, sketching, everything I worked so hard at what I was doing and there were two anyone which were my inspiration and they were supporting my efforts with their music. So alongside to anyone I liked Big Bang, Super Junior, I liked some sister songs and 4 Minute. Mm, K-pop in general puts so much effort in production, choreography, looks and put so much effort into their idols and my favorite is that they have these like promo stages where you can see them performing absolutely live but now it's different like third second gen I don't know which is which I'm not so good at this type of stuff but now it's different because of the high expectations of the fans that the companies prefer their idols to sing on pre-recorded track but that's another topic so I want to talk another big thing for me in K-pop the messages in the songs 80% of K-pop songs have positive messages while the other mainstream media is pushing I don't know if I can say the word with three letters and starting with S and the word with four letters that starts with T and ends with work so yeah while other media are pushing the boundaries with these, these type of videos which are provocative I just got sick of it I'm totally over those type of things but while other artists if I can call them this way were making everything but music the K-pop business makers were and are making high quality product with positive message I was tired of the singers promoting their bodies instead of their music so I switched completely into K-pop and literally I don't know what is going on with the American artists now because I don't care. Uh, the only problem is that I still after 9 years of listening to this type of music still don't know Korean. This is the main issue for me and I want to learn Korean. Let's get back to my story. I've started listening to K-pop because of 21. After that they've... not they but their company neglected them and they disbanded and I was so sad because these girls are unique after that Minzy's comeback was as a solo artist was amazing Ninano, Superwoman, ING I loved these songs like they were super 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 good after that Park Boom came back with Spring which was the best comeback ever and I listen to the song even now and Park Boom's songs are something which is timeless in my opinion of course but during the time that the group was still in waiting I have started liking other artists like EXID I really love the girls from this group they are super cute and I really love Soji I like LE I think Honey is cute Harin is super cute and Junwa is such a cutie so I really love this group not liking but loving them now I can say that to this moment from almost every group Tomorrow Hicks Together 
uh, BTS, Blackpink, I have favorite songs, but in my heart, 21 and EXID are the best groups. I love Sister, AOA, 4 Minute, Super Junior, Chunwa. I love Chunwa. Like I want to point this out. I am super fan. I love Hyanna. Super fan of her too. I love Tayon and Hyolin. I cannot tell you how I prefer one over the other artists because I love uh, the different aspects of every artist so I cannot say I love this one but I don't like this one every artist has its own charisma I love them almost every artist have a place in my heart so I really love K-pop another thing I want to point about these groups and singers is that they are down to earth uh, or pretend to be because we see only the facade but I love their personalities or the personalities they show. I have forgotten to mention that the solo activities of the members of these groups are not so successful. Not all of them of course but I think that Maybe it's because we have perceived to see them as a group. It's hard to break those type of barrier. So maybe they are stronger as a group. I don't know. And I hope you've liked this type of video. And I hope that I will be healthy to see you next week. So bye bye. And I love you so much.